This instruction movie will demonstrate how the pre-sterilized cytodex gamma beads are transferred into a bioreactor. Place the welder, microcarrier container, and single-use bioreactor close together for welding. Insert the appropriate welding block for the tubing diameter and a sharp blade into the welder. The cytodex gamma container is welded together with the single-use reactor using tubings of the same diameter. Check that the weld is okay and cool, and ensure that the outlet of the cell bag is open before proceeding. Slowly turn the container with the dry microcarriers upside down while gently shaking to get the dip tube above the surface of the microcarriers. This is a requirement for complete transfer. Place the container upside down in a holder. Connect the gas line for air or nitrogen to the vent filter that is connected to the dip tube. Open the clamp on the bioreactor. Apply gas pressure to the vent filter at 0.3 to 0.4 bar. Open the clamp on the vent filter tubing. Wait approximately 5 seconds to create a slight overpressure to get a good transfer before opening the clamp on the container transfer line. Shake or tap the container to get an even flow of microcarriers during the transfer. Check that the microcarriers flow into the bioreactor and that the transfer line is not clogging or restricting the flow. If using a wave bioreactor, ensure that the position of the tray is tilted during the transfer to avoid microcarriers covering the sensors. Check that all microcarriers have been transferred out of the container by tipping it back and forth. Close the gas pressure and disconnect the gas line. Close the transfer lines both on the bioreactor and on the container. Place the media tank close to the bioreactor, container, and welder. Weld the media tank together with the single-use bioreactor while disconnecting the microcarrier container. Place the media tank close to a pump and place the tubing into the pump head. Open the bioreactor tubing and the media tank tubing. Start the pump and check that the media flows into the bioreactor, which should remain in a tilted position to avoid creating air bubbles over the sensors. Stop the pump and close the inlet and media tank tubings. Start the mixing to initiate the hydration, swelling, and equilibration process. Equilibrate for at least four hours before inoculation by adding the cells directly to the media containing cytodex gamma in the reactor.